good morning beautiful people i hope you are keeping safe and well welcome to my youtube channel for those who i haven't met before i'm emma Ryder, psychic medium and divine channeler and this is a sagittarius reading please bear in mind that all of my readings are timeless and you'll find the guidance that is right for you when you need to hear it whether that is today next week next month trust in divine timing okay so we're going to use the inner child tarot to start with and then for your extended reading, I feel like we'll be going Troubadour Tower away, but we'll play that bit by ear as we get there. Okay, Sagittarius, what do we need to know today? Do, 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 Okay, I feel like I've got butterflies in my belly. It feels like there's some exciting energy coming up for you. It feels... um. exciting and maybe slightly a little antis uh, not anticipation yeah anticipation I feel like you're excited you know it's coming but then there's this anticipation like oh my god it's actually happening and I feel like if you're not feeling that yet there's something coming which you've been waiting for. I, I want to say the news you've been waiting for, the information you've been waiting for, the communication you've been waiting for. Something's coming you've been waiting for. And it feels like it fills you with excitement, but then there's the anticipation because, oh my God, it's about to get real. And it does feel very... Oh, card's falling out got the two of wands okay so it feels very overwhelming at times because it feels like a quick change you possibly weren't expecting just yet so then we've got the two of wands and I feel like this has been you this has been your daydreaming this has been your waiting this has been I suppose soul searching waiting not really being sure, just in that limbo energy where, and you're in limbo, so you can't help but overthink things, you can't help but worry and doubt. Well, guess what? You don't need to anymore because it's all falling into place. <laughs> then we've got the three of crystals, which is that jumping for joy, falling into place, very much happy and feeling free in the moment. It is that these butterflies, which you're getting from this information, which is coming, feels to make you feel very childlike. Not like you're going to be acting like a child, but that freeness, that in the moment joy, oh my God, it's happening feeling. And you're allowed to jump for joy. You're allowed to be excited. You're allowed to be looking forward to what's happening. Allow yourself. Don't stay serious. Don't stay in that energy where you've been for far too long. Break free. Enjoy it. Feel the excitement, feel all the emotions which are coming with it and knowing that things are just going to go and get better and better and better. Then we've got the Eight of Swords and this is why I feel like you're struggling to be in that moment and actually believe it's happening. Because you've been in a tunnel of darkness for too long, you've been in that energy of struggle, you've been in that energy of striving, pushing, trying, having glimmers of light, but then things not falling into place as you would like them to or as you need them to, and then you've had a little bit of hope and then it's been taken away. Well, that's the end of that. This is the end of that. 
You're letting go of the struggle. You're letting go how you've been. Believe it. It is happening. Oh my God, it is so exciting. It feels, it just feels very like I need to pinch myself, like I can't believe it's happening. And don't worry, you'll get used to the feeling. You'll get used to the change of feeling. The change in you where you're not expecting something to go wrong, but you're actually expecting everything to go right. Then we've got the Guardian of Wands. Because this is a massive transformational time for you. We've got transformation here and I feel it's like there's definitely a big transformation and healing around you. Because this has been a dark night of soul energy. And letting go of that and healing from that is change in itself. But there's more change than that. Because there's reason to be skipping, there's reasons to be joyful, happy and in the moment. And that transformation feels like it's all happening all at once, very simultaneously. So it does feel overwhelming, it feels like it comes out of the blue. But remember, you've been waiting for this change and you have the support of the angels around you. If you're feeling unsure, if you're feeling a little nervous with that little bit of anticipation, step back, take a breath and allow the angels to support you. Call upon that support you're needing, okay? You don't have to do this transition on your own, this transformation. There's a massive spiritual support team around you for that. But most of all, be in the moment and enjoy this. You've waited long enough. Then we've got the Nine of Crystals, which is very much that feeling of home. Feeling of home, feeling of contentment. Having those around you whom you hold most dear in your heart. And believing in it because it is happening to you now. It's all there. And this is coming as a product of that communication, of that news you hear. I feel like I just want to say you're finally home. Not just in a house, but you feel at home because you are surrounded by the people. It wouldn't matter where you are. Okay, beautiful. I'm going to head over to the extended reading now because I'm pretty excited about seeing more information around this and what this is all about and ha anything else you need to know. If this is where you leave me, then thank you so very much for joining me. As always, it is a pleasure. I'm truly grateful to be able to support you on your journey. Please do me a massive favour and like and comment on the video. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. I'm truly grateful for each and every single person supporting the channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Take care, stay safe, and I look forward to seeing you very, very soon. Namaste. Bye.